There's only one thing separating us from diving into boxes and boxes of Girl Scout cookies, a Girl Scout mega cookie drop. Let's check back in with Ashley Williams, who I know has had no work done. Hi, beautiful. Oh, my God. <laughs> I don't know where that conversation stemmed from, but I haven't had work done. <laughs> Not yet. Wink, wink. But take a look <laughs> behind me, guys. Everyone has arrived this morning. We're talking 1,200 troops coming to Rayleigh Field today to pick up boxes of cookies. It's an assembly line. The logistics are down to a T. Linda, this is an exciting day. People are excited. The cookie season has officially begun. What would you say is the most popular cookie? Oh, it's definitely the Thin Mints. We have extra lines for people to pick up Thin Mints because they are so popular. Well, you know, I gotta say, Caramel Delights, that's my favorite. Uh, yeah, so, so well, those are good too. Those are yeah. the second most popular Got cookie. So, Absolutely. So what would you say, in, in 2019, what would you say about business in the past? How have things been? Things are going really well for the Girl Scouts. We're so excited, and I have to really thank the community for supporting girls. We have more um, places where girls are selling cookies this year than we ever had. So we have over 13,000 sites throughout our 18 counties that girls can, that people can buy cookies from. Yeah. So that's amazing. You should not go without Girl Scout cookies you this should, year. You should not. Who? I don't know who goes without Girl Scout cookies, and if they do, they don't have a soul. Just <laughs> kidding. Just kidding. Now come on over, guys. Take a look at this U-Haul. People are coming in SUVs. Some sedans, but some are also coming in U-Hauls. I want to talk with one troop leader. Hi, Hi. tell me your name. Uh, my name's Stacy. Stacy, and what troop are you with? Um, troop 1800 out of Granite Bay, California. Right. So you woke up early. I so see you have your Starbucks, you have your coffee, yeah. you have your uh, road dog with right you. Right Why the U-Haul versus just a standard SUV? You know, we want to prepare for the rain. We got a lot of cookies and works every time. Really? Every year, three years in a row. Really? So <laughs> how long would you say the process is from the moment you get here to the moment you go home? Um, I would say after this, we go and meet all the moms, and so we drop off all the cookies, and so it's going to be done around noon today. Right, so. So it's a day full of fun. Day full of cookies. Awesome. Well, there you go. Have it. Thank See you, you later. Know. Thank you. Now, before we get out of here, we can't have Girl Scouts around and not get their sales pitch. Now, Canby, Tina, Darla, I don't know if any of you guys are ever in Girl Scouts, but I was. And let me tell you something. I went through like a boot camp trying to sell Girl Scout cookies because the sales pitch <laughs> has to be perfect. So tell me, who's going to give me the best sales pitch? Um, I guess Allie is. All right, Allie. Go to look, look at me. All right. Ready? Sell me cookies. Um, Hi, would you like to buy some Girl Scout cookies? They're $5 a box and we have eight different flavors. Wow, I would love to buy some, but where does the money go? The money goes to horseback riding, charity, and Mojo Jojo, and some other of our fun adventures. Awesome, I have a million dollars in cash. You want to take it? <laughs> sure. Uh, sure. Yeah, well, who's the She hesitated. She hesitated. All right, guys, on the count of three, we're going to toss it back. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, just going to say back to you, okay? One, two, three. Back. Bye. Oh my gosh, Allie's so cute. Also, I grew up with Ashley, and let me tell you, she did not go through an 